Welcome to Raven. It is day four in our quest to find the ultimate warrior. Through courage or cunning, these warriors have survived to face new trials. But the journey is long, and by the end of the day, only three will remain. Despite winning back a life in burning battlements yesterday, Ishal still begins today in last place with four lives remaining. Erska began as leader yesterday, but failure in Thrall Demons has brought him down to third. Diasa's early success in Swinging Ball allowed him to claw back to second place. Skia's triumph in Demon Square ensures that she begins today in first place. Gather yourselves and stay alert. If any of you lose your remaining lives during today's challenges, then you will be eliminated. Are you ready? Come. It is the early bird that catches the worm. Or the demon. in pairs to the clearing on the far side of the forest. But beware, this place is haunted by demons whose glare will turn mortals into ashes. Now, these vines will lead you through the trees, but do not leave the vines. If you do, you may be caught. Beware also of false leads. You will know one by the skull that hangs beneath it. Now, the winner of the challenge will attain a gold ring. The loser will forfeit a life. Skia, Isha, you will be first to walk the dark path. Remember, you must stay on the true path. Stray at your peril. Are you ready? Then let the challenge begin. Ishal must be careful not to go past the skull. Skia is on a false path and must turn back to avoid the demon's grasp. Skia is lost again. She must beware. Ishal must take care if she is to avoid Skia's mistake. Erska, Diasa, are you ready? Yes. Then let the challenge... Begin. Skull means Erska is on a false lead. Diasa must be careful. Erska, Isha, you displayed coolness and intelligence and have both won a gold ring. Place them on your standards. For you, Erska, the reward is a great one. You have seven rings and therefore win back a life.
Turkey, Diasa. The penalty for failure may seem heavy, but the rules are clear. You must now both lose a life. Remember, my young friends, the only real mistakes are the ones from which we learn nothing. Come, let us search out the next challenge. I was playing a game for Ski Car. I thought she'd win it, but then when we went through, I won, so I was pleased about that. And now I'm in third place with four lives and two rings. And I love the dark path, by the way. I was going quite fast and then uh, I turned onto the rope and I felt a skull. So I turned back and I just started going on another rope and another rope. And then I finally got the treasure ring and I was delighted because I was in third, now I'm in first. Now, my young fledglings, it is time for you to test your wings. If you look high into the boughs of the tree, you will see a platform. It is your challenge to climb to the platform, then leap from it, grabbing as many rings as you dare before you fly back to Earth. Now, Diasa, you will be first. Diasa, you were in last place with only four lives remaining. If you can grab all the rings, you may overtake some of your fellow warriors. Bad luck, Diasa. No rings, but at least you do not lose a life. Isha, if you manage to clutch all the rings, you may leap up into second place. Well done, Isha. One ring is yours. Remember, Skiha, make the leap or you will fall back to last place. Congratulations, Skiha. You made the leap and managed to grab one ring. Erska, you have five lives, but you must make the leap if you are to remain in the lead. One ring is yours, Erska. Well, my young friends, not one of you shirked the challenge, and three of you have won gold rings. Place them on your standards. But now we must travel on to the next challenge. Come. I was looking forward to doing the uh, delivery fight because I had to, you had to climb up and jump off to get a ring. And I got one and I'm still on first. When I was falling, it felt like I was going to be sick because, I, I don't know, it was just so scary and I couldn't stand up when I got down. I was going to go for three of them, but I forgot about the other two, so I would just jump for one. And when I was jumping, like, it felt like I was flying. It was so fantastic. When I went for the first ring, I just missed, I skimmed it, but it's okay, because 
I'm in last position now, but I'm going to work my way back up. Once again, we find ourselves in the shadow of the Wizard's Tower. Well, you already know the test here is grave, and one which must be faced alone. Erska, you have competed well today, and hold your lead with five lives and one ring. You must now return to the trial in the tower. But remember, you may choose one of your fellow warriors to assist you. I choose Giha. Come then, let us go. Beyond this door are gold rings, but they are well guarded by the thrall demons. They keep a slumbering watch over the rings that lie within a cat's cradle of spun threads. Erska, you will enter blindfolded and must try to capture rings without walking into the threads. Whatever you do, do not risk awakening the thrall demons. Skia will help you from this window. Are you ready? Then enter the lair of the thrall demons. Okay, one step forward and turn to your left. Two steps forward. Okay, uh, one step forward again. Another one. Okay, there's a string just in front of you and you're gonna have to crouch down. So, and step forward two. That's it. Okay, step, uh, turn to your right and walk forward one step. Turn to your left, walk forward two steps. Okay, and the ring is above you. Okay. Um, and turn to your right, step over. That's it. Okay, and turn to your right, walk forward one step. Now crouch under. That's it, walk forward two steps. That's it, okay, stand up. Okay, and walk forward one tiny step. That's it, step over. That's it, yeah, and the other one. Okay, okay, walk forward one step and get the ring above you, just in front of you, that's it. Okay, walk forward three steps. Okay, there is a metal frame just in front of you and you're gonna have to crouch down and step over at the same time. Keep your shoulders in and go forward, crouch down, go forward and step over, step over. That's it, that's it. Yes, well done. Yes. Okay, walk forward one step, another one, and get the ring. Congratulations, Erska. You completed the challenge without waking the thrall demons. Three gold rings are yours. Will you hold Skia's misguidance yesterday against her? Or will you reward her for today's success? I commend you for your good grace. Now, come, we must away. The day is already long and other challenges await. It was actually quite easy. Um, it was just hard to see the distance between where he was stood and the strings with the bells on. But we did it. <laughs> I was a bit worried there. Uh... If I didn't do the Frog Demons, because that meant uh, I'd go from first down to third. But I've done it and I'm really pleased. In this challenge, aptly named Ring Climb, you will need the agility of squirrels. At the top of these ropes is a gold ring. You will race in pairs to reach it, but you must be skillful and quick, for the warrior who fails to reach the ring will lose a life. Erska, Skia, your standards show you are the strongest warriors, and though you faced the last challenge together, you will now face each other. Are you ready? Then let the challenge begin.
Thayasa, Isha, neither of you can afford to lose a life at this stage in our journey. Are you ready? Then let the challenge begin. This race between Dayasa and Ishal is critical. It will decide which of them will face the final challenge of the day. Well, my young warriors, you showed both agility and courage in that challenge. Skia, Dayasa, you were first to the ring, and therefore win a gold ring each as your award. Place them on your standards. Erska and Ishal, you were second to the ring, and therefore must lose a life. Remember, my young warriors, never confuse a single defeat with a final defeat. Come, let us carry on. Skia's victory over Erska means that she is now first with four lives and six rings, just three rings ahead of Erska. Ishal and Dayasa have swapped positions with Dayasa on four lives and Ishal on three. It has been on their hearts and in their minds, but none have dared speak of it. Today, another must face elimination. That time has now come. The way of the warrior is the most difficult and perilous of all the challenges. Many a brave warrior has been swallowed by it. We cannot leave this place until at least one of you has tried and failed to pass along its golden path. Isha, you are the warrior with the least number of lives and must now face the gauntlet. If you succeed, then you will survive to continue on tomorrow's quests. The grim task will then fall upon Dayasa. Are you ready? Then may the raven's luck be with you. Let the challenge begin. In all his days, Raven has not seen a more brave or skillful effort. 
Ishal has justly deserved to continue to tomorrow's challenges. But now, the burden must fall upon another. Diasa, you are now the warrior with the least number of lives and must face elimination. Remember, if you fail, you must leave us and return home. Are you ready? Yes. May the Raven's luck be with you. Let the challenge begin. Diasa, though you must now step aside from the quest, you should carry your head high. You have proved yourself to be a true warrior. Farewell, then. The way of the warrior was easier than I thought it would be up to the shields. Then I found those quite hard. I'm disappointed to be here, but I feel that I did well, and I've definitely enjoyed it. I had a build time. So, now only three out of the six remain. Tomorrow they will face new trials and fresh challenges. Who will be the next to face elimination? The pressure mounts, but the heart grows stronger. Come, my friends, let us find the Ishal and prepare for the adventures of a new day. In the next episode of Raven, our three remaining warriors will be tested to their limits as they walk the high walk. They must survive on the blasted mountain. And who has the courage to face Navar, evil guardian of the portal?